It's a quick experiment. Line up a thousand people and give them a coin and have them flip the coin. Whoever gets tails, tell them to sit down. So it's about half. So 500 people left. You repeat it. 250 people left. 125, 60, 30, 15, 8, 4, 2, 1. Approximately half the people sat down every time they flipped the coin. Half of them get heads, half get tails. There's one person that's standing at the end. That person flipped heads 10 consecutive times. So who does the press go to? The press goes to that person and say, how do you feel about this? Well, I felt that heads energy about halfway through and I kind of knew I was gonna win. Did they interview anybody else who might have felt exactly the same way but didn't flip heads 10 times in a row? Because they're on their way home now. They're not there for the interview. So we're thinking that this guy had some kind of clairvoyance about his fate or that he prayed or whatever. And so whereas every time you do this experiment, somebody flips heads 10 times in a row. And so we don't know how to handle coincidences or things that are rare for you, even if they're common in total. So whatever God is, God is not luck. We can demonstrate that mathematically.